Well, that race, the racing world is mourning the shocking death of a local sprint car driver. David Steele died in a crash at the DeSoto Speedway over the weekend that was all caught on video. And he's now being remembered right here in Tampa and across the country. News Channel 8's John Rogers joins us now live from the DeSoto Speedway to talk about his legacy. John. Hey there, Josh. Such a sad story. One writer on Facebook put it best. David Steele was probably the best driver to ever strap into a sprint car, and many feel that racing will never be the same. On Saturday night, David Steele, number 33, tried to get off to a fast start in the opening lap, but he collided with another car, going airborne, spinning, and slamming into a wall. A lot of fans just sat there, just kind of, you know, in shock what they'd just seen. Just minutes earlier, Steele was taking pictures with fans and signing autographs, and now the racing legend is gone. I think everybody would know him as Superman. Joey Aguilar is his longtime friend. He was a big deal. For years, David Steele competed across the country, was regularly featured on national television, and recently completed his 100th Florida win. But he wasn't just a good racer, he was a good friend. I look forward to racing against Dave. He brought out the best of you, not the worst of you. Steele was a mentor to many drivers, and he also owned an auto parts shop. If anyone needed a part, he would gladly give it to them, even if they couldn't afford to pay for it. He, he's a fierce competitor, and he wants to win like you do, and he races against you, but he's trying to help you. Condolences poured in from throughout the racing world, including tributes on Twitter from NASCAR racers like Kyle Larson and Casey Kane. When NASCAR lost Earnhardt, NASCAR was never, has never been the same. It's the same way with Superman. Sprint car racing will never be the same around here or around the country. Such a sad and awful story. And just to give you an idea of how close and tight-knit this racing community is, uh, the uh, uh, the Speedway, the Showtime Speedway over in Clearwater, more than an hour north of here, they'll be hosting a fundraiser this Saturday offering ride-alongs and collecting money to give to David Steele's children for their college funds. So many all over the region and all over the country are touched by this awful story, Josh. Such a sad story. John Rogers, live for us in Manatee County. Thank you.